Hi, my name's Andy, or Altera Cosplay, and today I'll be showing you how to make this super cute DIY acorn hat. Here's a list of all the materials that I used. The 2mm foam is optional. Uh, one of the hats uses 4mm only, and one uses 4mm and 2mm. The first step is to download the PDF pattern that I have for free in the bio and print it out. Then trace it onto your 4mm EVA foam. Because the pattern is only half of the full shape, all you have to do is flip it over and then continue tracing, connecting the two halves. Next, cut it out. Make sure to cut all of the cuts at a 45 degree inward angle. This way, when you glue it together later, it'll be a lot easier. For the glue, I use Wellwood contact cement. Paint it on in a thin layer to all the seams and then let it sit for about 5 to 10 minutes until it becomes tacky. Then, once it becomes tacky, you can place the seams together and they should stick together with a nice strong bond. Once you've glued it together, some of the seams might not line up perfectly and that's totally okay. All you have to do is take some scissors and cut off the excess bits so that the entire bottom is flush with itself. Now this is where the tutorial begins to diverge a little bit from the two different variations I have of this hat. For the first variation, You'll be cutting out all the scales from 4mm EVA foam, and make sure to cut them at a 45 degree outward angle so that later you can sand it off and it'll have a nice smooth 3D shape. Then, starting from the top going down, glue on each scale individually to the hat. Once you've glued down all the scales and heat sealed your hat, take a Dremel and sand off the hard ed edges from the scales. This way you'll have a more organic looking acorn shape. For the second variation of this hat, you'll cut out all the scales using 2mm EVA foam. You don't need to worry about any specific cutting angle for these because it's 2mm, so even if you do cut it with an angle, you probably won't be able to see it that well. Then starting from the bottom going up, you'll glue down all of the scales. Next up we make the stem. Taking some 12 gauge wire, poke it through the top of the hat and tape it down and glue it down for extra support. Then take some foam clay and push it down on top of the wire to form the little acorn stem shape. Once you have the basic shape, you can use a plastic tool to shape in some stick-like grooves into the stem. Now it's time to break out those paint brushes, it's time to seal. I use Mod Podge to do a layer of sealant uh, on the foam before I start painting it. Then using just some brown acrylic paint, I just sort of kind of wung it, winged it, <laughs> I don't know, until I had a look that I liked. After I sealed it, it was finished and I had two cute adorable acorn hats that I had made all by myself and that you can make too. Once again, link is in the bio for the free pattern, and I hope you enjoy. Leave any questions in the comments if you have them. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.